Prime time, Kirk Cousins and the Atlanta Falcons will host the defending champion Kansas City Chiefs on Sunday night football. We all know that Kirk Cousins struggles in prime time, or does he? He's coming off a big win over the Philadelphia Eagles. Can Kirk Cousins make it back-to-back -back wins in a primetime game? We're going to talk about it, but before we do, i got to tell you about a promotion we have available right now at wagertalk.com. For a limited time, you can get $100 off any all-access NFL and college season package from any handicapper of your choice using the promo code FBALL100. Of course, that's available for all the great handicappers at wagertalk.com, including this guy right here. Uh, of course, as always, no purchase necessary. You're more than welcome to tune in just for the free picks. The only thing I ask from you is that you take the time to smash that like button, and that will allow me to keep putting out these videos. Let's get into the free pick. Uh, Atlanta is a three-point home dog. The total sits at 46 and a half. Money has come in on the Falcons. Uh, the Kansas City Chiefs got some bad news on running back Isaiah Pacheco. He's going to be out for a while. And backup Clyde Edwards-Hilaire also out of the lineup. And that leaves them pretty thin in the backfield. They got Carson Steele and Samaje Pirine. Neither of those are great options, in my opinion. Uh, Carson Steele, the, the rookie, flashes, or perhaps the, the youngster flashes some uh, potential, but he fumbled the ball last week. Uh, I wouldn't want to uh, put my put my put every all my eggs in that basket, let's say, and I don't think Andy Reid's going to want to put all his eggs in that basket either. Uh, Patrick Mahomes is coming off of a pretty bad game, 151 yards against the Cincinnati Bengals through a couple of interceptions. But he threw for 291 yards against Baltimore, and he's completing 71% of his passes so far this season. Uh, I like the Falcon. I lean Falcons as the home dog here, but I, I think the Chiefs are going to need to uh, throw the ball to stay in this game. I don't think they're going to want to run the ball with the uh, third and fourth string running backs. Um, you look at Patrick Mahomes' uh, passing yards averages. Last year, he averaged 261 yards per game, but the year before that, he averaged 309 yards per game. Uh, his passing yards total for this game, 266 and a half. And uh, I think in an indoor game, in a game that uh, is they're not expected to win easily, I think Mahomes is going to have to uh, turn to the, the short and mid-range passing game rather than running the football in, in this Sunday night football game. So play is on Patrick Mahomes over 266 and a half passing yards. If you like this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. And if you got anything to say to me, even if it's nasty, you hit me up in the comments below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can.